Your Roborock stops mid-clean and suddenly says, Error 18 fan malfunction. So what does that mean, and how do you fix it? Roborock Error 18 usually means the fan inside your Roborock isn't working right. That can happen if something is blocking the airflow, the fan is jammed, or the motor is damaged. This can also be due to dust, hair, water damage, or software glitches. Stick around, because by the end of this video, you'll know exactly how to fix Error 18 and stop it from coming back. Let's start with the easy stuff. No tools needed. First, power off your RoboVacuum and unplug the dock. Wait about 10 seconds, then power back on. Sometimes a simple reboot clears the error. Next, try gently clapping or tapping both sides of the robot. It sounds weird, but it can help knock loose any dust or lint stuck in the fan area. Then open the top and bring out the dustbin. If it's full or clogged, airflow gets blocked, so clean it out completely. Remove the filter from the bin. Rinse it and let it dry for 12 hours before putting it back. If it looks old or damaged, replace it. A blocked filter is one of the most common causes of fan errors. Don't forget to check for firmware updates using the Roborock app. A bug in the software could be misreading a hardware issue. Still not working? Try a factory reset. To reset your RoboVacuum, press and hold the home button for three to five seconds. While holding it, use a pin to press the small reset hole near the Wi-Fi light. Keep holding the home button for five more seconds until you hear it say, restoring the initial version. If the simple steps didn't work, grab a flashlight and look into the hole in the cleaning station where the dustbin connects to the dust bag within the dock. That's the intake duct. If you see any dust, gunk, or hair inside, remove it with a claw grabber or blow it out with compressed air. But don't use anything metal to avoid damaging the fan blades. If the error is still showing up, it's time to open the Roborock and inspect the fan. Flip the vacuum over and remove the screws from the bottom cover. Carefully open the top shell to access the fan unit. Look for signs of damage. Rust, black or brown dust, or a burnt smell. Any of these could mean the fan motor is struggling. Use a soft brush or compressed air to clean around the fan. Don't use water as the motor is sensitive. If it spins freely, that's a good sign. If it feels stuck or makes noise, the fan might be hitting the housing. One issue is that the fan blade starts rubbing against the housing over time. To fix this, cut four small washers from an old plastic card, each about one millimeter thick. Unscrew the fan's PCB board and place a washer under each corner. Then screw the board back on. This lifts the motor just enough to stop the rubbing. If none of the steps above work, the fan motor might be bad and needs to be replaced. You can find it on AliExpress, Amazon, or through repair shops. Match S50 model number before buying. To install it, disassemble the vacuum fully, unplug the old fan, and gently install the new one. Be careful not to damage the wires or grounding points. In case nothing works and you're still getting error 18, contact Roborock support through their website. When you reach out, make sure to include your serial number, proof of purchase, and a list of the steps you've already tried. Before we wrap up, here are some expert tips to prevent error 18 from happening again. Empty the dustbin after every use. Clean and replace the filter regularly. Avoid letting it run over wet areas or puddles. Check the fan intake area every few months. Keep firmware up to date using the app. Did you face error 18 earlier? Tell us your experience in the comments below. And for another helpful cleaning guide, check out this video next.